previously on Why Really Why. Hampton's Marathon, all right. You're not going to run a marathon. One of the risks is that you could have sudden death. Okay. I can lie. It's so fucking long. <laughs> Being young is a privilege. I drink, I smoke, I don't exercise, and I work the graveyard shift five nights a week. And after living like this for the past few years, I gotta say, I feel pretty good. So before it's too late, I've decided to test the limits of my youth and find out just how much mental and physical abuse I can take. What should I eat right before the race? Something healthy. Carbo load. That whole thing of carbo loading is not true. I, I was reading online about this and it says in your training that you should um, make sure you have the right clothing and you know what your hydration levels need to be. Right. And you know what you should eat before and during. And um, have you been doing any of that? No. Great. I'm gonna knock this thing out of the park. The day is upon me. I've spent an entire week not preparing for this, and now it's time to perform. <laughs> I got you start. <laughs> After getting off to a late start, Willie cruises through the first two miles and sits comfortably in the middle of the pack. It's really not that bad. It's not, it's not that bad. People just throw their cups. It's like, this is the Hamptons, you know what I mean? Through the first hour, he's run eight miles, but his early confidence is gone, and the pain has set in. Dude, my nipples, I think, are bleeding already. I'm fucking die. Oh, God. Oh. Let me in the car. We'll edit around it. Ian, can I get you anything? Anything at all? Water? Coffee? Frappuccino? A little cinnamon sprinkled on top? You good? Just want to make sure. Pull the fuck down, you asshole. Halfway through this 26.2 mile journey, both of Will's lungs remain fully inflated. competition is fierce at the Hamptons, but Will pushes onward while the dogs hold their own. Though optimistic, his mechanics have suffered. Based on his 15-inch stride, what he's doing is technically power -bombing. Unable to carry on, this runner has hit the wall. It takes strength and determination. A certain fortitude that only few possess. Seriously, I'm seeing spots. 
Maranek. Here's his first marathon finish. 26.2 miles. No walking, no crawling, never vomiting. All this talk about all the training it requires, hard work, dedication, please. If I can pull off this, then I can do anything. Because no matter the task in front of me, no matter how hard the road ahead might be, I will always do what I do best. Win. <laughs> that doesn't look good. Doesn't look good. <laughs> it's just unnatural. Yeah, yeah it's not very unnatural. <laughs> I'm not a very confident man. Oh, it hurts. Oh, honestly, I think my dick is like this big, <laughs> which is unusual. <laughs> All right, we're done. You know, it's not that I can't run. I can run for a while. Problem is, it's just so fucking boring.